used to be a storyteller, and this is a story which comes from Christmas time. Now, there was a dog, and everybody thought that this dog belonged to them, but this dog had not one single master. And it would go to doors, and it would scratch, 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 scratch upon the door, and the doors would always open. Now, I've got to tell you, I love the sound of squeaky doors. You ready? After three, here we go. One, two, three. I can't believe it. No training. And the doors would open up, and the dog would be given food. Now, one morning, it awoke. And I could not believe it because there were snowflakes falling from the ground that looked just like goose feathers. And as it spoke, I could see its own breath. And it started to walk towards the town, ready to go scratch, 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 scratch upon the door and find its belly full. But on this day, there were many people and they were walking along the road and talking about a baby. Now, the dog was curious, as dogs are. And as it got closer to the town, it could smell the food and hear the people and the talk about the baby. And it went to the first door and it scrit, 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 scrat, scratched upon the door and the door stayed shut. The dog couldn't believe it. And it went to the next door and it scrit, scrat, scrit, scrat, scratched upon the door and the door stayed shut. But this time it pulled itself up and looked into the window and when it looked inside, it could not believe its eyes, for there inside of the house, it saw that there was a tree. Now this was the funniest thing that the dog had ever seen in all of its life. And the dog laughed. <laughs> <laughs> God tries another. But I've got to tell you this, the dog laughed because it thought there are many trees outside here. They do not need them inside of the houses. And it looked and saw there was a fire. And there were lots of people standing and talking, singing and dancing. And it could see on the tree that there were candles. And at the top of the tree, there was an angel. And every door it went to, it scrit, scrat, scrit, scrat, scratched upon the door. And the doors always stayed shut. But now, there was only one house left. A house that belonged to the old woman. And scrit, scrat, 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 scrit upon the door. And this time... Now you've had one practice. The door opened up. Yeah. It's a big door. <laughs> you should see your faces. I've got to tell you this. And there was the old woman, and the old woman looked and said, Oh my dog, friend dog, it is good to see you. Come inside, are you hungry? And of course the dog nodded its head. Now we looked around the old woman's house, there was a small fire, there was no tree, no candles, no angels, but this woman, quicker than a wink or a blink of an eye, I was hoping for some help here, quicker than a wink or a blink of an eye, <laughs> haven't done it yet, quicker than a wink or a blink of an eye, quicker than a wink or a blink of an eye, she cut everything that was upon her plate, scooped it and placed it in a bowl for the dog, and the dog ate it as quickly as it could. The old woman smiled. Oh, it is good to have you here, my friend dog, my dog, my best dog in all of this world. And she sat down, and as she sat down, the dog was beside her, and she stroked at its head.